Ladies and gentlemen, we got a bad unit right here. This is a 2000 horsepower LS engine built by our boy Pete, the tuner. So HED, you'll see Harrell engine and dyno on these valve covers. And Motion Raceworks is hosting a giveaway that already started on the first day of this month and goes all the way until April 30th. And obviously you see this engine's covered in good old Motion Raceworks parts, but every $5 you spend on motionraceworks.com on say one of these freaking sweet new mullet t-shirts or throttle by like this, it doesn't really matter what you buy. Every $5 you spend on motionraceworks.com gets you one entry to win this insane twin turbo 2000 horsepower HED LS engine. Look at these heads. Zach, how do you feel about that? I've been begging for some mast heads for a while. Yeah, these are some insane heads built by our boy Pete. You got the precision turbs keys right here on the front, ready to rock and roll. Head to motionraceworks.com after the video. Every five bucks spent gets you an entry for this bad unit. Hell yeah, brother. You're on the Please Me Fallen YouTube channel. All right. Old McFlurry hitting the track tonight. Sam, you ready to see this polished up turd? This thing is ready go to go. Flying. It's cleaned inside and out. All the windows are clean. Back Good. window, it's cleaned underneath. The wheels are clean. Seat it's ready to go for you. Even, even seat belts. Really, the seat belts are lapped over. Wow. Yeah. It's ready to go for you. You know, everyone was kind of complaining that we were shifting the Lanko backwards, and then other people are saying we need to shift it the other way. Why don't the first two hits of the night, <laughs> we shift it one way, then we shift it the other. We figure out which way is quicker. It's, and then we stick I mean, with that for the rest of the night. And then we'll yeah. refute the ones that's saying it this or that. Okay, guys, we've done them both. And yeah. here's the one that works the best period, quickest time. Got the slip here to prove it. So we haven't gone quarter mile since we went a 480 in the eighth. I mean, this thing's going to sing into the mid sevens, I believe. Mm -hmm. And we got that home field advantage. Yeah. And we're back in Bradenton. So we got some decent weather tonight, and we're feeling pretty good. We're going to head over the track right now and get old Mick Flurry ripping down the track. Good morning, brother. Godzilla action. Man, we haven't even let this engine loose. Hand built by our boy Zach. Today we get to see what it can do. A little bit. I don't want to push it. We've got Streetcar Takeover Bristol. You know, this Friday coming up, April 21st. So I don't want to push this thing and hurt it, but I do want to see, you know, how much boost it can hold. We got those heads tucked in. We didn't really get to use them at TX2K, so. All right, so this first one, I'm gonna go left to right. I'm gonna left to right. So I'll put the list of gear ratios on here so you guys can see what they are. I mean, I don't 100% understand them, but I know that they stack on each other. So you guys do with this information as you please. Yes, sir, nice burnout. Oh, McFlurry in there banging gears. What's up, big pimpin'? Yeah, yeah, that way, a little bit to the, yep, uh huh. A little bit, yep, yep, yep. Right there, come on now, a little bit, a little more. There he is. <laughs> All right, baby. Seventy-nine, right off the bat at 173 dude that thing just went down like this is absolutely not, nothing this is not kill mode track by any means Okay, I think that's the wrong way to shift it because it's so short on the ratios and then you pull the last one, it's like, ah, da, 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 if that makes sense, I don't know. Dude, that felt, that felt pretty damn fast. Now it's a solid rip for left to right. Yeah. Where'd we go there? 
Solid rip. So, uh, solid. Solid rip. Like 779. <laughs> okay. 118, 490. So, yeah, that was a that was a 118.60 foot, 499 to the eighth. We already know it's been a 480 to the eighth. So it's just a matter of putting the boost back in it. But a 779, like it's not even trying. Right off, dude, it looked like you were just do 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 doodle bop through there. So now, for testing purposes, we gotta leave the same tune in it and do right to left. Yep. See what's faster. Obviously the car's a little bit hotter now, we'll let it cool off. Then we'll know, and then we go forward from there. I think that's the best approach. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're working with uh, about 20 pounds of boost in first gear, 20 pounds in second gear, 21 in third, 20 in fourth. Now the back, I mean, even 20. So I'm really happy with that for peak boost. The thing is, we need to get it in earlier. Ty, was this thing wheelie in or what? It felt like I was pointing at the bank, but <laughs> no, dude, it was. Well, my one is extremely soft. I've never touched the suspension on it. It's all box stock setting, so I would, I'd give her, yeah, three clicks. Cause I'll three. Her down. Well, I can't, I can't change nothing on this tune. Right yeah, you now. can't change it. Oh, yeah. So I'll put six in. <laughs> put, put three. Well, wait, wait, you wait, wait. You can't change it, dude. We gotta. It's not. It's good. We gotta run the, the yeah. levers if backwards. Tighten it up. It's gonna sixty foot better for sure. Okay. All right. So leave it, and then we'll go from there. And one last thing. The oil pressure. Let's get in on this uh, button over yonder. There she is. Get oil pressure, Samuel. Yeah. It's uh, it's eighty five the whole way, brother. Holy moly! We didn't even realize this when our <laughs> personal best McFlurry, the fastest it's ever been, was a seven eighty at streetcar takeover. And we never ran it out of the quarter mile the rest of the weekend. And then James had to go slow in Texas. So we just officially broke our personal best. We're in the 770s. Just like that. Unbelievable. I don't think we went faster, did we? Yeah, that was it. All right. Well, you know, I want to throw out there right now while we're talking about the transmission going left to right, right to left. There was no directions when I bought this transmission. <laughs> I mean, no one even told me a damn thing about how to operate this unit. And all trial and error. I mean, can they come on a set of directions? That'd be nice, you know? But hey, listen, this is what I've been doing for a long time, just figuring it out. So don't don't roast me in the comments unless you've dealt with this type of issue yourself. I mean, yeah, can I probably call somebody? Yeah. But you know, listen, I don't have that time for all that. No. I all mean, right. would a real American call and ask? No. Not happening, dude. No. All right, guys, got the car cooled down. I'm gonna go right to left. Same exact tune. We don't change nothing. Pass number two of the night. Going from right to left with the old gear shifters. We're gonna see if she goes any faster than a 780. Seven seventy one, way faster. It definitely liked that second gear. That it definitely liked that. Off of that, thing. that was that was real good there. Okay, yeah, I think we've been shifting it wrong this whole time. That sounded like normal gear splits. I mean, I could tell. It just felt a lot more normal. Even if that was slower, that was... I think that's definitely way more normal. It's not like... Rah, 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 rah. That was... Bah, 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 like, perfect splits. The cool thing is, at 60 foot of the exact same I saw it on the board because first gear didn't change. Brother, how did it feel? Same exact tune up. 
left to right. Let me let me see. So we did it by the book. Whoa! <laughs> Seven hundredths it picked Turns up. Turns out Stevie Fast does know a thing or two about uh, gear rate. About a thing yeah. or two. Okay, so we picked up six numbers to the eighth mile yeah. by going from right to left, which there was a lot of comments about that for a while, so. All right, you oh, guys are right. Oh, you guys are right. <laughs> yeah, but if you look at them side by side, there is no giant difference anywhere across the board. It just shaves a tiny bit off in almost every spot. Yeah. That eighth mile, though. But yeah, Actually, right. look at this. The 60 foot was slower on the second pass. Yep. Yep. But because of the gear ratios, it picked up a whole lot the rest of the way. She liked Science. it. Science, brother. <laughs> Crazy. You ready, dog? Oh, you just turned ready? her up? Click. Oh, okay. That should bring the spice. That's the hot tip. That should bring the spice. All right. We'll see. If it holds, it's going to rip. All right, brother. All right, you ready? This ain't about a rip. <laughs> Finally, the Fox Body Fast Pass we've been looking for. If it takes it, it's going fast. It's Fox Body, dude. Make Flurry more boost. Here we go, baby. Oh, oh, there she goes. Seven fifty four. Oh, my Lanta, one seventy three. Holy Toledo, dude. This car just wants to go fast. It's not like we're even trying. It only wants to go fast. Golly, I think I saw a 112 60 foot on the freaking board. That's unbelievable. It only took me three years to do that with my other cars. Bro, Bro. I already know that was fast. Dude. <laughs> Holy crap, 7.54, dude, effortless. Like nothing, I don't understand. 112.60 foot, 481 in the eighth, and 144, <laughs> 7.54. Not even trying. Dude, it loves it. Pack it up, dude, this thing's ready for a streetcar takeover Bristol. Right before the Danger Ranger, not only are we gonna get a W in McFlurry or Mullet, oh. Then we go to the Danger Ranger and get a win. So if you're coming to the Danger Ranger 9000 on dirt at Bristol next weekend, which is Saturday, April 22nd, Friday night, we'll be at the Bristol Drag Strip for Streetcar Takeover with McFlurry, which is now dialed in. We got a 770 tune up, a 754 tune up, <laughs> and I might make a little 7, you know, 40 tune yeah, up. For my yeah, boy Jeff. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. Out of water. We, break it we just knocked we came three here. tents off. We got a 480 car. Yeah. Oh. I think it's good Sam polished car. Off. Yeah, it is yeah, very, very smooth. Very smooth and slick. <laughs> That's it, guys. We just had very successful testing for McFlurry. We will have this thing ripping at Bristol Streetcar Takeover. That's it for now. Thanks for watching. New for available freaking. See you later.